doing something a little bit different and I don't really know what I'm going to call this. It's kind of like a residential to restaurant renovation. <laughs> I do have no idea what I'm going to call it yet but that's what I'm kind of planning on at the minute um, and I basically just had this random idea to just kind of like change up some residential lots into restaurants. Now I've, I say it do some but I've only done one so far which is this um, and I thought the pancakes house would be a really good kind of starting point for this because I mean it's got the word pancakes in the name <laughs> so I literally turned this into a pancake house um, and I've made it into like a brunch menu and um, so pancakes are on the menu so I felt like it was kind of a good kind of uh, thing to do this idea for now I don't know if I'm going to do it again it's a pretty random idea it's very simple as well I kind of wasn't really too sure about it once I finished because it literally took me less than 20 minutes. That's why this video is literally like six minutes long. <laughs> and um, I kind of felt like it was just like a cheat way out of a video. I don't know why, but recently I've been having this thing where if I make like a small a lot, like a, a speed build of like a small home or something, I always feel guilty kind of. It's really weird. It's really hard to explain it as well, but I just feel like I should be making bigger homes. So I'm like putting more effort and time into it. Um, so I wasn't really too sure about this one because I felt like I was just sort of doing like a cheat way out of a video because I literally didn't really change anything up with the exterior of the home. Now I did do that on purpose though because I wanted it to look like the actual pancakes house so it has a very classic design that everybody knows. Um, I was going to say knows and loves but I don't think everybody loves the pancakes. <laughs> um, anyway so what I did do to the exterior though is actually change up the landscaping just because I felt like I needed a little bit of an update and I also went ahead and changed the backyard area so I changed it into just like a general community area sort of so there's lots of outdoor seating and also a bar area and um, because I couldn't fit one inside and then inside we do have a big dining room and we also have a private dining area and uh, which has like just one big table and there's also the kitchen and then it goes upstairs as well I didn't change upstairs because I'd imagine that the pancakes household are maybe kind of just running this in there like as a new business Business, so they're still living at this place so all of the upstairs is exactly the same apart from the staircase though because I've changed the um, staircase from three tiles wide to one uh, just so I had a little bit more space downstairs which meant that I had to change one of the rooms upstairs to make it a little bit bigger to kind of uh, cover that space that I deleted on the bottom floor because it just was blank upstairs. Um, so we're on the interior now, as you can see. The kind of main, like the main floor plan is pretty much the same. I kind of just opened up this room out a little bit just so it's a little bit more spacious um, since it is a pretty small, it's only on a 30 by 20 lot after all. Um, and yeah, so let me know about what you think of this idea. I have just recently been trying to just think of just different and unique things because um as much as I love doing speed builds I think it is time to start doing some other stuff and creative sims and let's plays just do not work for me I've tried it in the past they're just never nobody's interested in them really so I feel like I should try and do some other things than just you know little speed builds and stuff um, and I'm not going to be doing these type of different things every single day you know I do still love doing other types of speed builds into my weekly mansion builds are still going to stay here but I just thought it was nice to do something a little bit different um, and yeah so the kind of um, decoration and all that sort of stuff is pretty simple as well because I felt like for this being a restaurant it's already kind of cramped and everything for there being loads of tables so I thought I would just kind of keep that on the low to not make it you know really over saturated with stuff I suppose um, and yeah so let me know if you kind of have like a maybe like a backstory for this or something I, I don't really know how to word that but maybe like the pancakes or something's happened and now they want to turn the house into like a, a restaurant sort of thing I don't know if you have a backstory for me the way of you know change it to that let me know and if you want to go ahead and download this renovated version it is up on the gallery I forgot to mention that my origin ID is real Thomas TV one I also gave this place some lot traits as well I gave it the chef's kitchen homey and convenial is that what it's called something like that <laughs> those are the three that I gave it I never really do um kind of just lot trades because well one I normally forget and two that's probably because I'm lazy <laughs> um so I, I thought it was nice to just kind of do it for a restaurant as well so um I do actually have another video coming up with the pancakes now it's in a very early stage and um, it's something that I've been wanting to do for such a long time and I've just never had the motivation to do it because I'm kind of lazy with this sort of stuff and you have no idea what I'm talking about but I don't want to ruin it um but mm, some of you may know, that's all I'm going to say. If you kind of are active with my 
social media, as I guess you could say, and just where I kind of post things, then you may have seen something relating to the pancakes that I've mentioned. And that's all I'm going to say so far. But stay tuned in the next couple of weeks. No promises though, because I don't know if this idea is going to work out. But I do have something kind of ex- exciting, I suppose, planned, which I'm really looking forward to to get it out. So thanks for watching. Make sure to leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe if you haven't. Go ahead and download this from the gallery. My origin ID is real Thomas TV one, and I'll see you all next time. Bye. Thank you.